Hey guys! Today our topic is Types of Bricks in Construction. So move toward our today's topic. <laughs> Types of Bricks Used in Masonry Construction Based on the manufacturing process, bricks are broadly classified into two types. Sun-dried or unburned clay bricks, burnt clay bricks, sun-dried, or unburned clay bricks. Sun-dried or unburned clay bricks are less durable, generally used for temporary structures. The preparation of unburned bricks consists of three stages process, and they are preparing clay, molding and drying. After molding, the bricks are subjected to sunlight and dried using heat from the sun. Therefore, they are not strong and has low water resistance and low fire resistance. These bricks are not suitable for permanent structures. Burnt clay bricks. Burnt bricks are good quality bricks, but also contain some poor bricks. Therefore burnt bricks are classified as follows. First class bricks. Second class bricks. Third class bricks. Fourth class bricks. Fly ASH bricks. Concrete bricks. Engineering bricks. Sand lime or calcium silicate brick. First class bricks. First class bricks are good quality bricks, as compared to other classes. They are molded by table molding and lit in large kilns. So these bricks have normal dimension, sharp edges and smooth surfaces. They are more durable and has more strength used for permanent structures. Due to their good properties, they are expensive compared to other classes. Second class bricks. The second class bricks are moderate quality bricks and molded by the process of rolling on the ground. These bricks are also burned in kilns. However, due to ground casting, they do not have smooth surfaces and sharp edges. The shape of bricks can be irregular, as a result of disparity within the ground. It will give the perfect results in strength, and durability. Smooth plastering on a brick structure is required. Third class bricks. Third class bricks are poor quality bricks, generally used for short-term constructions, such as unsaturated bricks. These bricks are not appropriate for wet areas. They are ground type bricks, and are burnt in clamps. A lot of these bricks has a rough surface and has inappropriate edges. Fourth class bricks. Fourth class bricks are very poor quality bricks, and usually are not used as bricks within the structure. They are crushed, and used as aggregates within the manufacturing of concrete, and they are obtained by overburning, because of which they become hot, and brittle in nature. Therefore, they can break easily, and usually are not appropriate for development purpose. Fly ASH bricks. Fly ash bricks are manufactured, using fly ash in water. These bricks have higher properties than clay bricks, and are very resistant to freeze melting cycles. These bricks have an excessive concentration of calcium oxide which is used in cement manufacturing. Thus it is also known as self-cementing brick. Fly ash bricks are lighter, therefore reducing the self-weight of the structures. The fly ash bricks have higher fire insulation, higher strength, better joints and the same size for plaster, much less water penetration. No need to be soaked before use in masonry construction. Concrete bricks. Concrete bricks are constructed using concrete, with materials such as cement, sand, coarse aggregates and water. These bricks might be manufactured, in sizes as required. Concrete bricks are used to construct masonry, and framed buildings, fences as it provides an excellent aesthetic appearance. Engineering bricks. These bricks have an excessive compressive strength, particularly for purposes where strength Frost resistance, acid resistance and low perforation are required. They're generally used in basements where chemical or water attacks are the main problem. For damp proof courses, sand lime or calcium silicate brick. These bricks are made from sand and lime, generally known as sand lime bricks. These bricks are used for many purposes, such as decorative work in buildings, masonry work, etc. Properties of brick. The following are the properties of bricks that replicate the significance of bricks in a building. Hardness. Comparative strength. Absorption. Hardness. An excellent high quality brick. Can have resistance against abrasion. This property known as brick hardness. Which helps to provide permanent nature of brick structure. Due to this the bricks of the property. Do not cause damage by cracking. Comparative strength. Compressive strength. Or crushing strength is a property of brick. That represents the quantity of load carried by the brick. Per unit area. According to Bayes, the minimal compression strength of brick needs to be 3.5 newton per millimeter square. The crushing strength of bricks 
decreases when soaked in water, uses different types of bricks. Bricks are broadly used for various functions. Within the construction industry, good high quality bricks, first and second class, are used within the construction of buildings, tunnels, pitching works and many others. Third class and unburnt bricks are used for non-permanent structures. Fourth class bricks are used as a combination for making concrete. Bricks are also used for architectural functions to offer an aesthetic appearance to the construction. If you enjoyed our today's video, then like and share our today's video and subscribe our channel.